Dave, uh, tells us what's in store out there as uh, firefighters work to get this thing under control. Well, temperatures are going to go up for tomorrow. Winds are going to die down a bit, so that'll help on the fire line. I don't know if you saw, but you can see that column of smoke actually having rotation to it and laying over because of those gusty winds today. All right, let's take a peek here at our CalSTRS camera and show you that tomorrow this shot's going to have smoke in it. I'm sorry to say it's going to be on the way and it might be around for a couple of days. We're going to import smoke from the north. Multiple fires are going to start to affect our area as early as tomorrow morning's commute. 83 currently in Sacramento, 86 Stockton, 89 Modesto, 90 in Marysville. The temperatures are fantastic. It's just the gusty winds going along with these cooler temperatures, especially in the higher elevations, causing some problems. Do note the dew points here in the valley are in the lower 50s, so humidity is up. That will help firefighters, but wind is never a friend to a firefighter. Tomorrow winds should settle down a bit, but the temperatures are going to go on up and again we'll continue on to the evening hours with the red flag warning and it's for mostly gusty winds in the higher elevations and up here onto the Dixie fire. Okay, so let's talk about the source of our cool air. It's right there. It's helping to bring in an onshore flow. The southerly and southwesterly winds because of this thing being so deep and dropping our temperatures so much that's giving the elevated fire concerns behind this high pressure is going to build on up and as it builds on up and comes on in the winds will shift around to the northwest and that is going to start to bring that smoke down here into the Central Valley, into the Delta, into the foothills. Everyone's going to get some of this. Even the Bay Area might get a little smoke and haze drift as we go through the next couple of days. Both days, though, with the smoke and haze, upper 90s, low 100s here in the Central Valley. So it will cool down after that for a little while, but it's not going to be pleasant for your Friday. So upper 90s, right around 100 degrees. You got some patchy smoke winds out of the northwest about 10 to 15. For Sacramento, winds will be out of the northwest 10 to 15, 102 over toward Vacaville. Smoke and haze pretty much everywhere. Looks like it'll be a two day kind of deal. For the gold country, you're going to import some smoke and haze because the winds will turn around a little bit and uh, you'll get some of that stuff in there up toward Plumas County. Needless to say, you continue with smoke and haze up there and daytime highs pushing right on into the low 90s and mid to upper 80s. So uh, today was relatively cool. That's better than it has been, even though it's going to warm up a little bit on the fire lines. Got low to mid 80s in and around the Greater Lake Tahoe area and some smoke and haze there. And then over toward the west, it could be just a little bit hazy. Temperatures will be in the mid 70s for Monterey, mid 80s around say San Jose and up toward Fort Bragg. Believe it or not, you're going to have some patchy fog up there. Temperatures in the mid 60s. Everybody else will at least have some haze and we'll have a few clouds to start over toward San Francisco and end up with sunshine with haze and temperatures running in the low 70s already back into the upper 90s for places like Fairfield. Seven day forecast. There's your triple digits, patchy smoke the next couple of days. Then we cool down to below average about normal. Then up it goes once again Wednesday on into Thursday with potentially some triple digits by the end of the seven day forecast. Cool over toward the coast. Everybody's going to have haze the next couple of days and it looks like we're approaching the upper 90s, maybe pushing close to 100 degrees toward the end of the seven day in the foothills and we're going to be pushing close to 90 toward the end of the seven day right there on into the Sierra. Elizabeth.